So the, the idea for the Great Lakes as a series just really came out of uh, a conversation about, you know, all of the natural beauty that we have in Canada and, and lakes and rivers being a big part of that. I mean, I think we all, or most Canadians have, have spent some time on a lake or a river somewhere in this country. And when you think about the Great Lakes as a, um, I think it's about 20% of the world's natural fresh water sits in those lakes and they're a huge, you know, piece of our geography. Uh, and we really thought, you know, if we got creative with how we applied some color and how we interpreted um, the landscape, we could make a really beautiful sort of commemoration of those bodies of water for people. Another challenge we had, of course, is that, you know, a coin is 38 millimeters, a one ounce coin. and um, you can't achieve the same sort of level of detail that you can on a, a, a full scale map, you know, that would unfold and, and be several feet wide. Uh, obviously the, the scale just, just doesn't work. So we had to work really hard to, to make our interpretations as true as we could to the data, but also make sure that we ended up with a coin that looked good and would, you know, be a, a good keepsake for people. When you're striking a coin, the metal has to have movement. Um, the different parts of the design have to fill properly. They have to create an nice even surface and so we had to um, be really careful about how deep we went into the coin and how uh, big the lake could be so that we weren't creating problems in other areas of the coin moving that much metal. Enameling is a, a really uh, delicate manual process. They use a very, very fine syringe um, and it takes a very long time. It's all done by hand and um, it's, they have to be very, very careful that the um, tools they're using don't scratch inside the surface of the coin, um, which you can imagine how thick a coin is. Um, it's a very, very small clearance for someone to work by hand. And um, that's a, it's a complicated thing to do, but uh, I think they've really done a beautiful job and um, it, it came out really nice and even and um, we're really happy with how they look.